Okay, guys, hey, give me a cheer if you're having some drinks tonight. Yes. Hey, I love getting drunk with my friends, right? I love it because when you do, they get impressed by every little thing that you manage to do. Like, I'd be wasted and I could just hear them whispering in the background. They're like, oh, my God, she can stand. <laughs> oh, my God, she can walk. And I'm just like, oh, my God. <laughs> Wait till they see me drive. <laughs> I will also address my voice, right? Like, I'm aware that my face is Chinese, <laughs> but my voice makes it sound like I start fights at pubs. <laughs> yeah, I think I'd be a great telemarketer for the pokies. <laughs> or a great spokesperson for the casino. Because my voice attracts the bogans and my face attracts the high rollers. <laughs> That was very nice. Sure, sure. <laughs> Sometimes I like to imagine my voice and my face as different people. Like, my face would obviously be someone oriental, and my voice would be someone who still uses the word oriental. <laughs> I feel like my voice sounds like the type of person to start a hate crime against my face. <laughs> And for that reason, I want to start the podcast for One Nation. <laughs> Just so I can be like, stuff immigration, I hate Asians, turn back the boats. And when they check the thumbnail, it's just me doing this. <laughs> and the caption's like, I really care about One Nation, China. <laughs> But look, as a Chinese person, I'm quite scared of US politics, right? Donald Trump in particular. I remember the last time he was president, he referred to COVID as the China virus. He hates Chinese people. He is so scared of us. I think it's because we actually know how to build a wall. <laughs> Yeah, but look, um, I, I love having the Australian accent as well, right? It's kind of universally adored at the moment. Uh, a lot of people think it's quite attractive. I'm like, is it? <laughs> I think it sounds quite goofy. Because you don't hear our hottest Australian celebrities doing the Australian accent in their films. Could you imagine Chris Hemsworth as Thor, just like, oh, no, not Thanos. <laughs> or Margot Robbie as Barbie, just like, oh, Ken, piss off. <laughs> And if Ken was Australian, he'd be like Barbie, and then he'd chuck a shrimp on her. <laughs> yeah. uh, a bit more about myself. Uh, I hate giving head. <laughs> I have no segues. I... <laughs> oh, really? That one got the clap? <laughs> all right, I hate giving head, all right? Because it takes so long. It's endless. <laughs> And there's no reference of time during it. <laughs> like, I want Head to be more like the game Mortal Kombat. So you can see a progress bar. <laughs> and then you could just do the same three moves over and over again. <laughs> right, like, forward, back, tickle, tickle. <laughs> when you want it to go faster, you do two moves at the same time. <laughs> And the guy's just grunting like, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> right? And you know the end is over. You know it's coming up because it would go, finish him! <laughs> Fatality. <laughs> hey, Melbourne, you've been wonderful. I've been Jenny Tian. Thank you.